Good morning ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another vlog on 88 Racing. Today we are here with this beautiful baby. She is a brand new uh, Kawasaki Z900. My bike. Obviously I got it recently. And we are going to test out how she performs on a stock exhaust. Because all the Z900s that we have uh, rode so far, they are all uh, on aftermarket exhaust. So we have never ridden a bike which is on a stock exhaust. The rear preload is pretty uh, loose loosened uh, so there will be a lot of shaking in the rear but we also have the beautiful Hayabusa with us today and it looks stunning it's clean beautiful this is a gen 1 I guess uh, it's a 2004-2005 gen Hayabusa so and it's still not that bad I mean I've seen this guy go and he's still pretty fast maybe later in the day if I'm a little <coughs> tired, because I'm not too well, if I'm a little tired, I might be, like, you know, putting Chris on this bike and might shift to that. So, let's see, and let's get on the ride first. Hi guys, follow me on Instagram to get more of such awesome content. And the first thing that you can notice on this bike is that the on-off throttle transition is really jerky. You see off and then you see that jerk feels like a jolt let's attack some corners now help from the traction control holding the lines well actually feel an interference from the traction control which is good which means you don't know where you're exactly losing the grip but the stock tires I mean I have felt a lot of uh, Z900s and I have ridden them even on track and This one feels a little soft and the feedback from the tires not that great. He just didn't check his rear view mirrors. And this is why I'm a little scared of doing high speeds. So I saw Twinkle and uh, uh, Chris's girlfriend waiting over there. So I came down on my speed a little bit. And you can see the Busa. The big Busa is struggling <laughs> because of its weight. 
it's struggling on the hills it's pretty fast on the straights though but as soon as you hit the hills and the corners the mighty high abusa struggles a little bit to turn maybe because of all the weight take some good shots yeah boy full power cruiso well the traffic scene doesn't seem to be as bad as it was on sunday so let him take the two corners first looking good i think now let me overtake and let's stretch our legs a little bit so this village we have to come a little slow comparatively i mean than the other places zone Whoa. I'm just hiding here uh on the subway I mean on the parking lane and not on the main road so that I can fool them into going and one guy has gone Akash and I'm still waiting for Krisho yeah so now Krisho is gone and he doesn't know that I'm waiting here <laughs> let's go and surprise him guys have already entered bhai kahan hai so we have just finished our lunch and we have come out of the beautiful excellency resort and there's chriso riding my beautiful beautiful z900 we're thinking what to name her maybe panther because she's all black and uh, I'm going to try out the beautiful mighty Hayabusa for a while. Oh, right at the bat. You can feel this is a bloody monster. So bloody big this thing is.
a small pull that I did on the Hayabusa and fuck it was scary I couldn't even open full throttle that's scary but it's also interesting because unlike what I thought the Hayabusa is actually a little comfortable let's see the angel the lights going down and before it does it's time to bid farewell to all of you uh, do let me know in the comment section how you feel about the vlog and how f you feel about our roads and our rides uh, also to make sure to subscribe to my channel press that bell icon and also follow me on Instagram my Instagram handle will be down in the description below so with that said this is Sushank Sharma saying goodbye from 88 Racing. See you in the next vlog.